the House State Government Finance Committee has announced plans to fund three critically needed veterans' homes across Minnesota. Using excess funds from the Viking Stadium Reserve account, the bill would fund veterans' homes in Bemidji, Preston, and Montevideo. With financial backing from the state and local communities, the federal government would cover 65% of the veteran homes' costs. Now, the Viking Stadium Reserve used to fund the veterans' homes currently has an excess balance of $58 million. The reserve is expected to grow to $120 million by the end of fiscal year 2021. Under the bill, the stadium reserve account would be capped at 125% of the annual payments of the stadium bonds. The House bill ensures excess funds are put to use rather than sitting idle while still protecting against the drop in revenues. Currently, there is no cap on the amount of the reserve. Today, members of the House State Government Finance Committee, as well as stakeholders and advocates from the communities seeking funds to build the veterans' homes, discussed the new proposal at a press conference at the Capitol in St. Paul. This is a great move. I'm really looking forward to it. It's, it's long overdue. The longer we wait, the more expensive this becomes. We need to do it now. And our veterans' population is aging, and it's very, very critical that we move forward on this now. We've merely in our pro forma, identified a dire need in northwestern Minnesota. I hope veterans all, all throughout the state will stand by us as we stand by then and once and for all get the job done so that services delayed will not be denied anymore and that we fully honor the moral obligation of taking care of veterans. Uh, as a person who has to deal daily with the families who are impacted by the lack of homes up in our area, I will tell you this is a huge step I can't wait to see it come to fruition. I can't wait till we start laying down some bricks there in Bemidji, Montevideo, and down in Preston. So uh, I'm just saying I'm, I'm so excited. Right now, Minnesota has five veterans' homes. They are located in Fergus Falls, Hastings, Laverne, Minneapolis, and Silver Bay. The five have a total of 824 beds. Currently, a veteran is placed on a waiting list for more than a year before getting placed in a home. A new veterans' home has not been built since the mid-1990s. Officials at today's press conference say even if the money were approved this session, it could take five or more years to open the new homes. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.